Hello everyone, my name is Tim Stack and in this set of tutorials I'd like to go through the process of using Audacity to record, edit, and produce a podcast. Now the first step in this process is to make sure that your microphone is installed and working properly. So let's go through that process. I've plugged in my USB microphone and headset into the USB plug on my computer. Then I'm going to go to the Start menu and to the Control Panel. And here in the Control Panel I can access the Sound Settings. So if you're familiar with the new setup, um, I can find the Sound Settings here under Hardware and Sound. So let's click on that. And I can change system sounds or manage audio devices. I think that's the one I want. Let's open it up and see. Okay, so now our settings. Um, for playback, I would like the audio to come out the headset. And the headset I've plugged in is the C Media USB headset. You can see that uh, Windows has automatically selected that. So that's great. If that didn't automatically get selected, then you can just click on the one that you want to select. Okay, now I'm going to go to recording, the next tab back across the top. And you can see there's a couple options here for microphones. Again, Windows has recognized the headphones that I've plugged in and that has become selected. At this point I can see there's a little levels meter or a volume meter over here on the right hand side. So that's um, telling me how loud the input volume is set. So if I'm not too loud of a talker I may need to turn this up. So if I have this microphone selected, you can see it's highlighted blue. I can come down to the properties and under properties, so this is the properties of that microphone, this USB headset microphone. And as I look along the tabs at the top here, there's a levels tab and you can see it's pulled all the way up to, to its maximum. So that's the loud as it need, that I can, I can make it. But if I talk really loud uh, or I have a really good microphone, I need, may need to turn that back a little bit. I'm going to click OK to set that. And you can see the levels meters, meter here um, sort of bouncing up and down as I talk. If it's hitting the top all the time as I talk, especially when I say P's or T's, um, then I may need to go back to properties and turn it down a little bit. But right now it looks just fine. I'm going to click OK. So I've told Windows about my microphone. Now I've opened up Audacity. So you should have a, a shortcut on the desktop here, or you may find it under the Start All Programs menu. There it is, Audacity. So once that's up and running, I now need to make sure Audacity is set up to recognize this microphone for audio input and my headphones for the audio output. And the settings for those are under the Edit menu, down to Preferences, and you can see the different preferences we can set over here along the left hand side. I'm going to choose the audio I slash O which just means input output. And I open up um, under playback here, that's for the headphones. So I open that up and there's probably a whole bunch of choices there. What I'm looking for is the first one that says USB headphones. Okay, then I'm going to go to the recording device which is my microphone open that up and select the same one. This one said MME colon microphone USB headset. I want that one. And then my microphone is not stereo so I need to change this to mono. Now one little thing at this point if you had uh, turned Audacity on before you plugged in your microphone your microphone headset the, the your microphone headset will not show up on these lists. So you, all you have to do is turn Audacity off, turn it back on, come back to the Audacity preferences on the input and output, and then your headset microphone will show up on this list and you can choose it. But I do believe most microphones are going to be need, need to be set to um, mono, not stereo. I'm going to leave everything else here default and just click the OK button. All right, now just a quick test while we're here. I'm going to go up inside of Audacity here, press the big red record button. So I'm going to press that and then I'm going to click this square stop button when I'm done. And I'm just going to do a quick little test here.
testing, one, two, three, four, testing, one, two, three, four. So uh, I'm sure it should be fairly obvious that I was able to record that video. I can see this waveform happening as I'm speaking. Uh, so I know that my microphone is connected. Windows knows about my microphone and Audacity knows about my microphone and headset. In the next tutorial, we will start recording in Audacity and editing our recording.